Welcome back, Pixelites. It's Ghost Wolf here, and I'm here to give you a quick trade tutorial for trade signs. So here on what will soon be the Pix or Pokeopolis docks. And so each person or block will have a small area set aside for their stalls, and what you can do is place your trade signs everywhere and sell things even while you're offline. So here's how they work. So you just place a sign down. The first line will always be trade. The second line will be what you want. So if you want to make money from an item, you put dollar sign, five, or whatever you want to put for your price. If you want an item, like a Pokeball, you look up what the Pokeball item ID is. So like for Pokeball, it's Poke B. If you want a Pokeball lid, it's a Poke, it's Poke L. Pokeball disc, it's Poke D. The TMs all have their own things. You just pretty much just look it up and you'll be able to find out what it is. So let's say I want to buy a Pokeball. Then you put what you actually want to trade. So let's say I want to give one apple for a Pokeball. Kind of a bad trade, but, you know. So you put one apple, and you put a colon, and then after the colon you put how many of it you want to remove from your inventory. So if I want to remove one apple, I put one. If I want to pay money for it, I could put five dollars, and then how many, do how many total dollars I want out. So say I wanted to buy just one Pokeball, I only put $5 in the sign. If I want to put, buy two Pokeballs, I have to store $10 in the sign. And if you do the sign correctly, it'll have the trade on the top blue. If the trade on the top is red, something was set up incorrectly on the sign. And what you can do is, if I want to add more money to the sign, is once it's empty, you can just click the sign and it will add more item with the item you want to add into it in your hand. And you can add more money if you want to just keep buying Pokeballs every once in a while. And you can also have, you can collect the colon, whatever, so no one has used this sign, so there's zero Pokeballs waiting for me. But if somebody had used it, it'll be a one or a two or whatever. And you just click the sign and it'll pop into your inventory. So trade signs are pretty easy to use. You can place them anywhere where you have build access. You can do it on your personal claim as well. Or you can put it out on the trading area in the docks as soon as we build them. Alright, I'll see you Pixelites later.